Having said that, Sunil, coming to your team, Bengaluru FC, you all have created a niche already. A major footballing uh, landscape has been occupied by you all in the last five, six years. What are you doing right? What are the structures, systems, corporate involvement, for example, uh, whether it's that IIS trading center done by JSW, what are you all doing right as a team? Well, Barua, there is a uh, uh, lot of uh, reasons why probably we are doing all right. If I have to name few things, I think one is that the owners, the coaches, uh, the team behind the team, the players, everyone is in sync. Everyone is very hungry to improve, which is which is paramount for a team to do well. You can pick any individual from the team, and if you talk to the person, the person has desires and dreams to improve. Uh, there is not much interference into each other's job. There's a lot of mutual respect and love. Uh, there's a lot of stability. A lot of right people at the right job is probably why we are doing well. And let me tell you, the players aren't the top most performers of our club. There are so many others who probably people don't know and, 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 and listen about are the ones who are driving the team. Collectively, everyone pushes each other. Everyone because he or she aspires to become better, is rubbing that same thing to the other person and that's why the team is going forward. We may lose, we may win in coming days, but one thing is for sure, the club really wants to improve. That's music to my ears and that's what professional football club or a franchise should be about. About you personally, Sunil, I mean, second highest goal scorer and we've celebrated you for the longest. And year on year, it is Sunil Chetri who's the sign of attention. How do you deal with that pressure? Your good friend Virat Kohli, for example, deals with it in a particular manner. I was watching that Instagram chat. Uh, but in your case, you are calmer. Uh, two very different kind of leadership styles, both equally impactful. What is your vision for sport? You said at this time of your career. But I still think at this time of your career, you still have plenty to give our sport. Talk to me about your career at this point and your leadership uh, uh, philosophy. Well, first of all, I do not take things too seriously. Uh, I think the kind of life I've got, uh, Boryada, I think it's an unbelievable life. Uh, I am where so many kids in our country aspire and dream to be. I have got uh, so much uh, in my life from football that I don't take any of it for granted. Uh, I'm living probably more than a dream you know if 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 17 years 18 years back when i started if you would have asked me you know what here is here is a pen and a paper write what you want in your life i couldn't have written what i've got right now so i'm really fortunate a lot of people have worked really hard for me to reach here so the least that i can do is get up every day and, and be as hungry as possible and give everything on the pitch and that's what i do i'm enjoying my game uh, physically i i've never been more fitter I've surrounded myself in life with lovely, amazing individuals in my life who help me, push me every day. And probably that's why I'm, 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 I'm doing all right. I think enjoying at this stage what you do is very, very important. You know, when you start, there are a lot of things that you play for, you know, fame, money, trophies and stuff like that. But now, for most, I play for, for the enjoyment of the game, which is taking me back to my childhood. Because when you start as a young boy, you just want to enjoy the game. And that's what I get the feeling now. So I'm, I'm really enjoying it. Uh, the only thing that I do is I go and give everything that I've got because the game has given me so much and more that I could have never even dreamt of. You know, Sunil, the reason why you are who you are is because of this humility and modesty. I mean, I, uh, more important than a performer is what you are as a human being. And I know you for several years and decades now, and that has not changed. That's why Sunil Chetri remains the beacon of hope and light for Indian sport because you're a true ambassador of this sport. Having said that, so Boryada, if, I, if, really I, if I sort of Boryada, yeah. if I if I if I can what? interfere, I'm I'm not trying to be humble, Boryada. I'm I'm just trying to be honest. I, I'll tell you a small uh, day of my life. Uh, I think every day my job is just to get up happy, train hard, sleep well, and that's it. There are so many people behind the scene who work hard for me. You know, my my dad and my manager is my best friend, take care of all my finances, all my investment. My poor wife has to get up early in the morning and think about all the meals I'm going to have, the kind of naps I'm going to take. Everything in my household works exactly according to what Sunil Chetri, the player, needs. So I'm not trying to be humble. I'm being very honest that my work is very easy. My work is to get up happy, eat well, train hard and sleep. That's all I do. That's everything so many people work hard on. You know, I think the physios and the masters who work so hard just so that I can go and train to my optimum level. All these people around help me so much and they go unnoticed so many times. I mean, even without 
any one of them i wouldn't be who i am and i'm not trying to be humble again i'm just trying to be honest that's a fantastic answer because that tells me why a mumbai indians wins or a delhi capitals make the final or a bengaluru fc dominates is because of the the structure behind it is not the day it is about preparation for months which is True. beyond True. the camera that's what sunil was talking about whether it's sonam whether it's uh, team jsw whether it's his uh, sponsors whether it's his uh, coach and physio and monsieur it's it's that team sunil chhetri that makes him who is fabulous answer sunil the other point i want to touch upon is with isl whether it's uh, you know fsdl and reliance whether it's jsw whether it's rpsg i see serious corporate involvement and that for me is music because ultimately you need that level of corporate support for indian football to progress in your case whether it's puma supporting the bengaluru fc team you personally this year again it's a global brand that helps indian football will you agree that isl has made that difference it really has i think there are many uh, factors why indian football has done uh, decently well in the last 5 10 years and isl definitely is one of the protagonist i think i know it i've spoken about it the whole country knows it just to take the whole sport domestic sport to a different level has been one of the main uh, uh, outcomes of isl coming to indian football you know just the euphoria the understanding the reach that he has is it it's outstanding i mean all the players every one of everyone who aspires to be a footballer is, is right now uh, you know getting the benefits of isl and in coming future also they're going to get i really i really really think so that isl coming in in football has been a, a blessing for indian football